Hello and welcome to this Dr. Ross video on determining a fraction of a fraction of an amount. Let's read the question. There are 1,200 people at a concert, three-fifths of these people are children, the rest of the people are adults, an eighth of the children are female. Work out the number of male children at the concert. Now there's lots of pieces of information here, but we just need to deal with it one step at a time. Now we're told, for example, there's 1,200 people, and you're told that three-fifths of these people are children. So let's work out how many children there are in total first. So number of children we're told is three-fifths of the people, three-fifths of the 1,200, of 1,200. So three-fifths of 1,200. And remember how you find a fraction of amount? You divide this number here by the denominator. So you divide the 1,200 by five, and then you times by the numerator, so you times by the three. So 1,200 divided by five, which you can do in a calculator if you want, but it's 240, and then 240 times three is 720. So there's 720 children. Now it says the rest of the people are adults, but it doesn't mention adults anywhere else in the question, so it might be that we don't need to use that. But we are told an eighth of the children, and we worked out how many children there are, there's 720, an eighth of the children are female. So let's work out the number of female children. So that's an eighth of the children. So an eighth of 720, there's 720 children. And to do that, we divide the 720 by the eight and just times by one, which won't have any effect. 720 divided by eight is 90. So there's 90 female children, but we want to work out the number of male children. Well, let's think about this logically. If we have 720 children in total, and 90 of those children are female, the remainder are male, so we just need to subtract these numbers. So the number of male children is 720 minus 90, and that gives you 630, and that's the final answer.